Our research, which is carried out in the Department of Chemistry, involves the construction, the synthesis of new materials for energy storage and energy storage devices such as batteries. And more specifically, we tend to work on lithium ion batteries and sodium ion batteries and also next generation energy storage devices. So the more traditional types of materials that are in your cell phone uh, do not necessarily rely on nanostructuring, although they often tend to rely on nano coatings to stabilize the electrode materials themselves. But the new materials that we're looking at really do rely on nanotechnology and nanostructuring in order to build the material because it's effectively comprised of two parts, one that does the active work and the other that delivers the electrons to the active material. And those have to be mixed intimately at the nanoscale level. The Department of Energy in the U.S. is actually um, creating an energy storage hub to create a center for trying to improve upon energy storage. So in the last five years, there have been a lot of changes as many more people have moved into the area and also a lot of new ideas and new technology that's just starting to come out has been really nice to see.